I want to talk about a property boom in Metro Manila, described as the best in two decades. It has pushed construction in the Philippines to its highest growth in at least six quarters. And an increased confidence in the country's economy shows no signs of a slowdown. In the first of our five-part series on the booming real estate market in the Philippines, Channel News Asia's Christine Ong tells us why observers consider this the best time to invest in the sector. From office buildings to housing projects, to hotels and new shopping districts, the Philippines is experiencing a property boom like no other. And it's all being fueled by confidence in the Philippine economy, which grew at a notable 7.1% in 2012. With the Philippine economy growing at an impressive pace, experts say that there will be no slowdown in the demand for real property market as the country rides on strong macroeconomic fundamentals and investor confidence. We're seeing a, a very strong government. I think the Aquino administration is, 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 doing a, is doing a very admirable job. And I think they've got um, you know, strong leadership and a strong cabinet. And I think that's um, being reflected in the confidence of of foreign investors. I think uh, a lot of countries around the world now you see getting investment ground downgrades. The Philippines are seeing investment upgrades. So that's, that's very positive. The Philippines has become this overnight success that took 20 years. Property developers are now enjoying brisk sales with vacancy rates falling to its lowest on record. In some cases, pre-leasing for office spaces are committed for the next two years. The challenge now, experts say, is how to cope with the unprecedented success. The challenge actually not only for us as a, as a company, but the challenge for our country is how to sustain this growth. How do we sustain it? It's really through plowing back all the income of both the private sector companies and the government into sustainable projects and relevant projects. For example, it's very important for the government really to expand our infrastructure. There is a big uh, need, we, we know it, um, to hasten the infrastructure program of the government. The government has allotted a record budget of over 9 billion U.S. dollars this year to upgrade the country's roads, ports, bridges, and airports. Industry experts believe the aggressive infrastructure spending will further real estate growth in the country. Christine Ong Channel News Asia, Manila.